Let me explain about the process going from rough idea to realization of a project. There are seven distinct stages in a project, each with its own specific start and finish point. I'll discuss them here briefly, mainly to explain as to where we are in this particular project. Stage 1. I call it Pro, as it is the stage where we are about to meet a prospective client and see if it's a right fit. Stage 2. Analysis. We've been awarded the project and we start with the analysis of the requirements, which we then translate into a design brief. Stage 3. Zoning. This is the translation of the programmatic needs into a spatial diagram. Stage 4. Schematic design. We bring the plans into 3D. I like to keep the design in black and white during this stage so that we can focus on the spatial qualities of the design. Stage 5. Design development. The design is being developed further and materials, colors, lighting are introduced. Stage 6. Construction drawings further detailing in order for the contractors to provide us with their estimates. Some revisions might be required to bring the design within budget. Stage 7. Construction. The contractor is selected after a bidding process and construction starts. As architects we perform regular site checks and attend construction meetings. So for this particular project the client went down the design build route. So this means that the architect teams up with the contractor and provides the client with both the design and an estimate. Whereas in the procedure I explained before, the architect is selected early in the project and takes the client through the design stages towards an open bidding stage leading to construction. During the design build project, the selection is somewhere within the SDDD stage, which is where we are at the moment.